September 3rd, Tuesday. Looks like we got ourselves a civil war in Chicago. Listen to this. To all Venezuelans in Chicago, this is, this is the war. You ain't on no bullshit, stay neutral. Stay neutral. If you know somebody that's in your building on bullshit, don't let them run in that building. And don't let nobody see them running that building. Because one's word get out that that's the building that they in. They gonna chop that bitch down. Whatever building, the abandoned building you y'all occupying and all that shit, yeah, you better get your food and just stay in the house because they come out doing some bullshit. Y'all gonna regret that. You gonna really regret that. So I don't speak Spanish, so somebody need to translate. Take it for, take this like a grain of salt if you like. But this ain't Colorado. This ain't Utah. This ain't none of them places. This is just like where you're from. The only difference is y'all use a lot of handgun, old revolvers and machetes and shit. We got switches. We got switches. If you're not familiar with what a switch is, we will show you. We will definitely show you what a switch is. So, again, somebody translate. Make this known. This ain't, this ain't like, this ain't like Chicago's the home of Al Capone and gangsters. You got the Latin Kings, you got you got the Bloods, the Crips. I mean, it's a long list of street gangs in Chicago. Any police officer out there could tell you there's a whole bunch in all over the place. You got all sorts of gangs in Chicago. And we got some breaking news as of a couple minutes ago. This was put out 52 minutes ago. Chicago 911 reports armed Venezuelan trespassing. 32 allegedly armed at a building. Let's listen to this. Okay, what we got here is already there's going to be gang wars. What's going to happen here, in my opinion, street gangs in Chicago that's normally always been fighting against each other, and they're going to unite with the civilians, the people in the neighborhood, are going to back up. And I imagine since the police arrest these people over and then they're turned over to ICE and ICE releases them back into the community, things are going to get hot and heavy. There's going to be alliance like you've never seen alliance before among the the street gangs and the, the people, the civilians, because they they know what time it is. I mean, these guys get, what, $10,000 a month on food stamps, $5,000 cash, free housing, free medical, free Social Security, free this, free rent, homes, and they could do anything they want. They come into the hood and do anything they want. You think people are just going to sit back? Think people don't know this? And they already know about the... The, the voter fraud that goes on. They're already speaking out. So the now it's not only the black community that's sick and tired of this, this shit. It's also the Latino community and the whites, male, female. Of course, you're going to have your radical feminist uh, brainwash individuals supporting faker that's running for. But people are going to realize, hey, it's the wild, wild west. It's El Capone days. It's time to defend the hood. That's, what's, that's the mentality that's going to go, in my opinion, that's going to happen here in Chicago, Illinois. This is going to be the epicenter of the civil war of this invasion. thought I'd just throw that out there. There's so much more happening. The ego is being destroyed from within. And believe me, it's not about the country anymore. It's about the hood. It's about your home. It's about your house. It's about your neighbors, your families, your, your relatives, your, your neighborhood. That's what it's going to come down to. Self-preservation is the first law of nature. And we're talking the jungles of Chicago. So what you're seeing here is just the beginning. And other, it will spread out to other cities where you're going to have a, a banding together. Even the white gangs, whatever, they're, they're going to unite. They have no choice. It's self-preservation. And that's what I see. That's what I see coming.